I'll walk you through three fixes for the DX11 feature level 10.0 is required to run the engine error in Windows 11. Let's get started. At first, press the Windows key plus X keys together. Then, tap on the Device Manager to access it. When the Device Manager opens up, expand the Display Adapters section. After that, right-click on the Graphics Driver and tap on Update Driver. Now, tap on Search Automatically for Drivers. This will make Windows search for the latest driver. If it can detect a new driver, let it install. You can skip any further steps of this fix. If you see this, the best drivers for your device are already installed message. Tap on Search for Updated Drivers on Windows Update. After that, tap on Download Now on the Settings page to download the latest driver. Just wait for the process to be complete. Then, restart your system to complete the process. Sometimes the game itself might be missing crucial fixes and patches. Check the Steam page or Epic Games Store page if you can find any updates for the game. If you can find one, install it immediately. Then, check whether you can play the game or not. At first, press the Windows key plus I keys to open the settings. Now, click on Windows Update. Then, tap on Check for Updates to check for new update packages. If Windows can't find an update, tap on Download Now to download and install the latest update. This shall update Windows to the latest format. Just reboot the system once and try to play the game again. At first, press the Windows key plus R keys together. Then, type DXDAG and hit Enter. If you see any prompt asking for your permission, just tap on Yes. When the DirectX Diagnostics Tool window opens up, go to the System tab. Now check the DirectX version. This way, you can get an idea of what version of the Direct3D feature your system is using. You can now go to the Microsoft official website, download the latest version of DirectX, and install it on your system. At first, download the setup file of DirectX. Once you have downloaded the setup, double click on the DX Web Setup. Just select the I accept the agreement. Then tap on Next to proceed. Now the DirectX setup will determine the current version of DirectX installed on your system. If it detects there is a new version available, it will download and install it on your system. After that, just restart your system after you have finished installing. Thanks for watching. If it helps, make sure to hit like and subscribe.